breakthrough in what could be a major game changer. 14 patients with advanced rectal cancer are in remission after taking the same drug. It's a small trial, but so far it had a 100% success rate. The tumors are gone with no chemo, no radiation, no surgery. Out front now, Dr. Andrea Sursek, an oncologist at Memorial Sloan Kettering. She was part of the research team that conducted this study. Uh, and Dr. Sursek, you know, of, of course, when I, I saw this, I, I stopped dead. I think everybody does when they hear the, the headline that cancer could be gone. I mean, it seems impossible. It certainly is remarkable. Um, from your perspective, how remarkable is the outcome you observed? It's absolutely incredible. We, we didn't expect it. We've certainly never seen this before. Um, it's really what, you know, cancer doctors' dreams are made of, to see a, a response like this, such incredible efficacy with really almost no toxicity. Um, our patients feeling great after the treatment with completely normal um, body function uh, in something like rectal cancer where normally our therapies are, are really uh, quite toxic. So it's, it's absolutely incredible. So can you tell me more about the drug? I understand it's called dostarlamab and, and why you think it worked. So it's an immunotherapy um, and it works by unlocking the body's natural immune system to fight cancer. And, and this type of therapy works in specific uh, cancer cells in colorectal that are mismatch repair deficient. So it's a, they lack a gene that enables them to repair their, their DNA. And because of that, they have many, many mutations and the immune system recognizes the cancer as foreign. And so when we give immunotherapy like dostarlamab, it really just revs up the immune system so that it sees the cancer and gets rid of it. And But what's so remarkable here is that it completely eliminated the cancer. The tumors just vanished in all 14 consecutive patients. Normally when this, was, when this is used in colorectal cancer in patients with advanced disease, that happens in about 10% of patients. And here it's 100%. So that's really the most striking part of this is that it happened in every single patient after just six months of therapy. So doctor, could it go, this be a, a broader use? I mean, you're talking about rectal Absolutely. cancer specifically, but I mean, you know, any other type of cancer. Absolutely. That's our goal. You know, the, the, the idea here is that we move this therapy from advanced disease into early stage disease. And clearly we're seeing that there is increased sensitivity when the tumors are early stage, when they are in their organ where they begin. And so our goal is to replicate this in other solid tumors such as stomach cancer, pancreas cancer, and bladder cancer that are mismatch repair deficient where they have this potential sensitivity to immunotherapy. And it can have huge implications just as it did in these 14 patients where they didn't need radiation and they didn't need surgery. We may be able to, to achieve that as well in patients with stomach cancer where surgery may not be needed if they have the same type of uh, you know, really remarkable response. Well, doctor, I really appreciate your time and explaining this. I know obviously it's, it's, it's 14 people and, and you know, I don't wanna, I don't wanna blow it out of proportion, but the headline itself is, is pretty stunning. And as you point out, uh, remarkable. Thank you so much for taking the time to explain it. 